वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स स्टैंडर्ड फोर्थ सब्जेक्ट मैथ्स चैप्टर नंबर नाइन वर्ड प्रॉब्लम्स एडिशन एंड सप्रैक्शन पार्ट टू सो स्टूडेंट वी हैव स्टडीड अबाउट एडिशन एंड सप्रैक्शन वर्ड प्रॉब्लम नाउ वी विल कंटिन्यू फर्दर एडिशन एंड सप्रैक्शन मिक्स प्रॉब्लम नाउ सी द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन य इन अ नर्सरी देर वे थर्टी टू थाउजेंड वन हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी सैपलिंग्स ट्वेल्व थाउजेंड सेवन हंड्रेड एंड एटी नाइन वे मैंगो सैपलिंग्स एंड टेन थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी थ्री वे टी सैपलिंग्स हाउ मैनी अदर सैपलिंग्स वे दैट सो स्टूडेंट वॉट इज आक्स य नंबर ऑफ अदर सैपलिंग्स वॉट इन्फॉर्मेशन इज गिवन टोटल सैपलिंग्स दैट इज थर्टी टू थाउजेंड वन हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी मैंगो सैपलिंग्स ट्वेल्व थाउजेंड सेवन हंड्रेड एंड एटी नाइन टिक सैपलिंग्स टेन थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी थ्री सो फर्स्ट वॉट इफ वी आर गोइंग टू डू वी आर गोइंग टू डू फर्स्ट एंड वॉट वी आर विल डू नेक्स्ट दैट इज सप्रैक्शन नाउ वी विल डू द एडिशन यर दैट इज ट्वेल्व थाउजेंड सेवन हंड्रेड एंड एटी नाइन प्लस टेन Nine plus three, twelve. Two down, one you are going to carry. Now eight plus one, nine. Nine plus two, eleven. So one down, one you are going to carry. Seven plus one, eight. Eight plus four, twelve. Two down, one you are going to carry. One plus two, three. Three plus zero, three. And last one plus one, two. So your answer is twenty-three thousand two hundred and twelve. Now we will do subtraction. So total number of sapling is given how much thirty two thousand one hundred and forty, and now we find no mango and tick saplings. Total is twenty three thousand two hundred and twelve. So we'll minus that. Now from zero we cannot minus two, so we'll borrow from next number. That is four will become three, and this zero will become ten. Ten minus two eight, three minus one two. Now one. Is there from one we cannot minus two, so we are going to borrow from next number. So two will become one, and this one will become eleven. So eleven minus two nine. Now here again from one we cannot minus three, so we'll borrow from next number. So three will become two, and this one will become eleven. Eleven minus three eight. Two minus two zero. So the answer is eight thousand nine hundred and twenty-eight. Other saplings were there. Okay, students. Now see the next question. Lalita Bain donated rupees seventy five thousand to a hospital. Rupees forty seven thousand five hundred were used for equipment, and rupees eighteen thousand two hundred and forty were used for medicines. How much money still remain? So, what is asked here? The amount still remain. What information is given? Total amount she donated that is seventy five thousand, and. Forty-seven thousand five hundred were used for the equipment, and eighteen thousand two hundred and forty were used for the medicine. Okay, so what will you do first? We will do addition, and after that we will do subtraction. Okay, so look here. So first we will do addition. Amount used for equipment is equal to rupees forty-seven thousand five hundred. Amount used for medicines is equal to rupees eighteen thousand two hundred and forty. So we will add that first. Zero plus zero 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 plus four four five plus two seven seven plus eight fifteen so five down one you are going to carry up four plus one five five plus one six so your answer is sixty five thousand seven hundred and forty okay now subtract this number from the total donation so total donation was given seventy five thousand amount used for the equipment and medicine was sixty five thousand seven hundred and forty. So we will minus that zero minus zero zero. Now zero minus four you cannot do. So you are going to borrow from the next number. But next number also is zero. We will take from next number. So five will become four. Zero will become ten. Now from ten you are going to give one number, no? So ten will become nine, and this zero will become ten. So ten minus four is six. Nine minus seven is two. Now your four is there. From four we cannot minus five. So we will borrow from next number. So seven will become six, and this four will become fourteen. Fourteen minus five is nine. Six minus six is zero. So the answer is, therefore, rupees nine thousand two hundred and sixty still remain. Okay, students.
Now, making problems based on the given information and solving them. Means make an addition problem based on the given information and solve it. Make a subtraction problem based on the given information and solve it. Okay, student. So the information is given here. Rupees three thousand nine hundred worth of fodder and rupees two thousand five hundred and seventy worth of other animal feed. This is the information. So we have to prepare a question. Addition problem. A farmer purchases fodder. For rupees three thousand nine hundred and animal feed for rupees two thousand five hundred and seventy, how much total amount did the farmer spend? So he has brought the fodder and animal feed. So how much amount he has spent? So we will see here. Cost of fodder is equal to rupees three thousand nine hundred. Cost of animal feed is equal to rupees two thousand five hundred and seventy. So zero plus zero 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 plus seven seven nine plus five fourteen four down one you are going to take up three plus one four four plus two six so the answer is therefore rupees six thousand four hundred and seventy the farmer spent okay now subtraction problem how you are going to do a farmer purchase fodder for rupees three thousand nine hundred and animal feed for rupees two thousand five hundred and seventy. Find by how much did the fodder cost more than the animal feed. So we have to find out how much the fodder cost more than the animal feed. So answer cost of the fodder is equal to rupees three thousand nine hundred. Cost of the animal feed is equal to rupees two thousand five hundred and seventy. So this we will do subtraction. Now we will start with unit side. That is zero minus zero zero. From zero, we cannot minus seven, so we'll borrow from next number that is nine. Nine will become eight, and this zero will become ten. Ten minus seven is three. Eight minus five is three. Three minus two is one. Therefore, rupees one thousand three hundred and thirty did the fodder cost more than the animal feed. Understood, students? How you are going to solve this way sum? Okay. If it is mixed problem, then addition and subtraction. First addition, then subtraction, and if it is given the information, then you have to prepare the question for both addition and subtraction. I hope you have understood today's chapter. Thank you.